Japanese nuclear experts investigating the cause of the Fukushima nuclear accident on behalf of lawmakers will begin full-fledged work in January. The panel was set up by the Diet and is independent of the government. We will examine reports from the IAEA and Tokyo Electric and an interim report from the government investigation team. We want to focus on problems they were unable to address. The panel will scrutinize how then Prime Minister Naoto Kan and other senior government officials responded to the nuclear crisis. It will also propose ways to change Japan's nuclear policy and administrative systems to prevent another nuclear accident. The panel will submit its findings in about six months. Japan's ruling party has come up with a way to pay for the rising costs of Social Security. The Democrats plan to raise the national sales tax. The decision came after nearly nine hours of debate. The current consumption tax rate is 5%. DPJ members agreed to raise it to 8% in April 2014, then to 10% in October 2015. Prime Minister Yoshihiko Noda faced strong opposition, so he decided to delay the start of the new system by six months. But that wasn't enough, so the party executives amended the plan. The revisions include reducing by 80 the number of seats in the lower house and salary cuts for public servants. The plan allows the tax hike to be suspended depending on the economic situation. Noda faces dissidents within his own party, too. Some have already left the Democrats to protest the tax hike. His administration hopes to submit the bill to the Diet by the end of March. Radiation levels now for eight-plus months uh, have been off the charts in many areas of the United States, different isotopes, readings in the milk and the uh, vegetables that are grown on the surface. Cows then, of course, eat the grass off the surface and it bioaccumulates. In some cases, uh, milk has had over 100 times what they say is normal or safe levels in it. But now they just wave magic wands and raise the isotope levels and say it's safe. Wasn't safe in 86 with Chernobyl. Now they just wave magic wands. And they wave magic trendy wands uh, because the New York Times or Michael Medved say so. And, you know, it's good for you. It's like the London Guardian now says it's trendy and radiation's good for you. George Mambiot actually said it's wonderful. Anyone that doesn't like it is insane. And you just wave a trendy, know-it-all, bossy wand, and everyone is supposed to listen to you. Kind of like Ron Paul. They wave a magic wand and say, he can't win, you're not supposed to vote for him, he's dangerous, he's evil, he's bad. And you're supposed to get in line and say, oh my gosh, a group of confirmed deceivers and manipulators and preemptive warmongers who've helped turn America into a bankrupt cesspit of global tyranny uh, are now telling me new lies. It'd be like getting at the end of a sewage pipe and watching all the horrible affluent, the detritus come out, and then, and then somebody says, you know, I wouldn't sit there and uh, get a spoon and eat what's coming out of the end of that, and you see all this black sludge coming out, and they look at you and say, you're a conspiracy theory. Uh, this is uh, apple pie, because the government-run media said so. And they're like, but it stinks. It's coming out of the end of a sewage pipe. And they're like, shut up, conspiracy theorist. Conspiracy theory is thinking and asking questions and not believing out of hand what confirmed known liars say. And so I am a conspiracy theorist. I'm going to admit it right now. Uh, we've had a bunch of top scientists on, probably more than, I don't know, 20 or so in the last nine months since Fukushima happened. And the fastest currents from Japan go up to Alaska and northern Canada. And uh, they reported just a few months into it. Uh, massive increases in radiation levels in the fish uh, and in seals, and now MSNBC is reporting scientists test sick Alaska uh, seals for radiation, and uh, it looks like they're dying of radiation poisoning. Nothing like seal teeth falling out, nothing like their hair falling out, nothing like blood coming out of them uh, as it, all the fast-growing tissue dies. You get hit with radiation, that's what happens. Y your gums die and start bleeding fast growing cells are hit the, that's why children are so susceptible because they're 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 fast growing cells everything in their body is a fast growing cell except for eggs in a child's ovaries if it's a girl and your eyeballs that's it 
everything else is changing and growing. And you get hit with radiation, it's much worse. But an adult, only thing that's really fast growing is your skin, your gums, your mucous membranes, your intestines, and a few other things. And boy, when you get hit with radiation, bye-bye intestine lining, bye-bye teeth. And that's happening to the seals. When radiation levels spiked massively from Fukushima nine months ago, the fastest sea corridors bringing uh, the, 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 the radiation to North America within a month and a half had hit Alaska. And we had reports then of radiation levels going off the charts. What did the EPA do? Federal government? They just raised the level of what they said was safe. They said, you know what, this isotope's gone up, we'll just raise the level of what we say safe. Well now, seals with damaged flippers and hair loss are being killed by radiation from Fukushima plant, biologists warn. And they've done the test, the radiation level has gone up. They first thought it was a virus, but they're not testing positive. That same wreckage of all the tsunami uh, cities and towns, that got carried out to sea. Water traveled in some cases in a month and a half to the coast of the U.S. and Canada and Alaska. The wreckage started hitting three weeks ago, and it's highly radioactive. All those houses, all those reactor parts, that's hitting the West Coast. Kids are dropping dead all over Japan. Heart failure from the radiation. And our government's response, the Japanese government's response, is everything's fine. In 86, with Chernobyl in the Ukraine, the Russians said, don't drink milk, don't eat surface food for six months, we've got to ship it in. All of Europe refused to eat the food. They shipped it in from America and other areas. For much lower radiation, this time they're saying, just go ahead and take it, everything is fine, it's going to be good for you. Keep working on it, Japan. Okay, Ted, what's the problem? Hello, Betty. What's the problem? I haven't got a problem. I've got fucking problems. Plural. Want to hear? Sure. Well, most recently, there's room 309. Here's a look at how people and animals are marking the end of 2011 here in Japan. A Shinto shrine in a rice-growing town made an offering of a huge rice cake. It's a way to thank the gods for this year's harvest and ask them for a quick recovery from this year's earthquake and tsunami. The rice cake is nearly a meter high and weighs 500 kilograms. A forklift carried the two lower layers to the hall of worship. It took 12 shrine attendants to lift the top layer into place. They topped it off with a huge piece of fruit that's also part of this New Year tradition. <laughs> Animals are also marking the end of the year. A sea lion named Jay is practicing writing the Chinese character for dragon, the zodiac sign for 2012. <laughs> Jay will soon show off his writing skills at New Year events.